Terry Dairy Stone and the Great Cape Lost Cox, France. 17,300 years ago. Hi guys and welcome to a new episode of the channel and today we'll talk about the Lost Cox Express. And we also have stones to build it. Ow. Alright, about stones, there's a lot of things that we still need to talk about here. In the Lost Cox Cave, there's a lot of things. There was once a chief who wants his successor to be a skinny boy named Willow. Who's not strong, but he was pretty smart, like his mother. And then there was a lot of things that happened here. The chief was out of respect. And then, well, somebody, there was a hunter who said, I want to write the next half done! And became pretty much really mad here. He became barbaric and said, let's kill this guy. And sent bison at the chief. And the chief was like, okay, run away. But before he could even run away, he was knocked. He was knocked by the bulls, and he bladed and died. And he said hey, the names of his last successor. Willow. And then, well, Bull, there was the hunter called Bull, said, I will be the next leader, because he was pretty much greedy here. And everybody said they wanted Willow to be the leader because everybody heard Willow be no leader. And they decided to fight for it, but it turned out Willow would lose anyway. And that was pretty much it. And Willow went into hiding inside the cave where his father used to paint. And he started, and then he got some paint. And he started drawing. He will eventually learn it himself. He drew a deer hunt, and then he, and then his secret was found out. But then when he saw the new paintings on the caves, they were like, hmm. And Pooh was like, he was older now, and he was like, ooh, I'll return, I welcome you back to my tribe. As long as you paint, I will let you stay. You will be chieftain with me. And pretty much the end. And the true story was that during World War II, a group of teenager, teenage boys went, went running, went hunting with their dog. The dog fell into a hole, and when, they, when the dog fell into the hole, there was pretty much some. They rescued it, but when they went inside, they found out there was an entrance to the cave. There was a painting of a man falling down from a cliff. That story of the Great Cave was just a guess of what might have happened and what the thing represents. Eventually, the breath, the CO2 from their from human breath nowadays, grew, made fungi grow on the painting, so it destroyed the paintings. But then. It was closed down, the cave was closed to tourists. But then they made a new cave some, somewhere near it. Near it. And, and they called it Lost Cox too. They recreated all the paintings to make it look exactly, well, not exactly, just a lot like it. And so that's how it works. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did enjoy this episode, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you. Next episode, Shanghai out and peace.